All right, how's it going? This is Cole Rolf, and welcome back to RimWorld Beta 19. So we have Thomas and Susamu visiting the nearby colony. Um, can't remember what their name. Something about the Mesa. <laughs> Anyways, to, basically to complete a caravan request, and the reward that they're providing is um, a tech prof uh, for instant research, which will be excellent. We've got a shaman merchant here now. Cool. All right. Well, we will trade with them in the morning. Probably have Livy do it to keep raising her social skill. And there's cargo pods. My goodness. Just all sorts of stuff going on. What is this? Oh, it's hops. Okay. Well, you can bring those in. We're not really doing beer production right now. Um, trying to get a lot of other things managed. <laughs> uh, we still have uh, Sarah and um, Lee Lubinar. Lee Lubinar, I think. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that, and I apologize to anyone who does. Yeah, so she's got asthma, but other than that, she seems like a really good colonist. So we're going to try and recruit them both. I think I've got them both set to recruiting. Yep. And I know Sarah does, because we've already gone through her resistance. Actually, now that I think about it, um, we should get more beds uh, made. Because they would end up sleeping over here. And let's get a few extra ones because I'm sure they're not going to be great. Livy is still sleeping when she wakes up. Oh, there we go. Switching up for a cloth toque. Oh yeah, I had Lindsay um, turn off a few more... Uh, what am I trying to say? A few more bills to get things done, and she is just rocking it. Yeah, um, let's turn this one off suspended. Yeah, she's just making lots of clothes, so that's wonderful. Cheering up patient Circa. Good, so once you're done that, whatever you're doing next, we're going to have you go trade. Let's see what these guys have. Do, 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 do. Also want to get some um, deadfall traps set up in a couple of places for defense, just to help out. Now that we've got a bunch more people coming. Oh, you're going to wear a cowboy hat, sure. I'll let you do that. And then... Yeah, we'll feed a simple meal in just a moment. There we are. Let's go trade quickly. Don't imagine there's a whole lot of stuff that um, we want from them, but apparently they've got turtles. <laughs> yep. Uh, we're not making Nero... Neutroamine. Neutroamine. Ugh, can't say it. Neutroamine is for uh, various drug production and medicine. We're not doing that yet. Oh, wow. They've got Sandy Lancer, Sooth Pulsar. Hmm. Well, we're not really interested in that. Or pretty much anything you've, else you've got. And we're going to hold on to this stuff. So, all right. Thank you for your time. We will trade next time, maybe, depending on what you guys bring. But, um, yeah, we don't have anything you're interested in. So I did see the notification these guys are running out of food or run out of food. Visitor. <laughs> Zed, the jailbird. Okay. All right. Um, doesn't look like they're anything, they have anything to trade or whatever. Yeah, so I notice these guys are are out of food, so they're just eating berries. So when they arrive, we'll probably get them to buy some meals as well once they sell some things. Yeah, it was a little confusing last episode exactly how much food to send, because I kept sending more food and it kept not really changing anything. Oh well. Anyways... So, yeah, what else is going on? Still 
Hey, sir, did I see you just eating a fine meal? Huh. Oh, we've got fine meals now. Oh, good. Excellent. That means we are on top of our food production. We're switching over to making fine meals. Good job, guys. Yes, Harry, it's great to have you making meals again with us. And once that taps out, he'll get back to doing research. Oh, and Livy is constructing. Got two good beds. Three good beds. Great. Wow. Okay, maybe we can even switch out some of these normal beds for good beds. Good. Excellent. Huh. Let's see. We need more crafting getting done. Because uh, we've got lots of blocks, but they're not being constructed into bricks. So... Visitors are leaving? Okay. Oh yes, Zed. <laughs> Take care, Zed. And hauling's not getting done right now, I see, because the... Um, uh, wood fuel generators are not getting fueled. Yeah, okay, I guess because Thomas and Susum are primary haulers. And there goes all the lights. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, they should be back soon. Uh, yeah, they're almost there. And they're using their bedrolls that we remembered to send them this time. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I could definitely use two more colonists to kind of help round out a few more tasks. Well, it'd be good to have another constructor and a miner to help. Um, we've had a lot of these tasks that I've set up to be mined for a long time now. They're just sitting there. And Thomas isn't really getting to it, and no one else has a passion for it, so... Not incredibly um, critical that we get this done. Another person is passing by. Spider. Okay. All sorts of visitors, just starvation, Susumut. Oh yeah. Okay. You're almost there. Once once you get there, yeah, point two days. You're almost like get there. Sell off those Yorkshire Terriers, and then I think the food will settle out a little bit. Oh, trade caravan is leaving. Take care. Let's see. Security. Wooden spike ball trap. Yeah, let's get a few of these set up. Oh, you can't place them diagonal now. You, there's a whole ring around that you can't place these. Well, that's probably a good idea, really, because you could, you could spam them pretty densely and then it gets a little you know a little much oh they've arrived good so let's where are we here oh yeah there we go fulfill trade offer yes we will definitely do that and then we would also like to trade with them we are going to sell you a lovely bunch of Yorkshire Terriers. There you are. Enjoy. Have a great time. Let's see. Oh yeah, food. They've got lavish meals. We will take... They're going to be pretty hungry. <laughs> we will take all these lavish meals. Buy some medicine. A whole bunch of stuff. Should come back more often. Yeah, I brought the extra cloth just to make sure. Probably didn't need to, but whatever. Yeah, meds. Let's get some real meds. There, we got eight silver left. And yeah, that should be fine. Okay. Except let's send these guys back home. So yeah, so we've got enough food. They'll probably eat a bit of food right away because they're they're hungry and starving. But 35 Wow. Those uh 
Orchard Terriers are really slowing them down. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, maybe what, maybe what we do is we just don't need to build these ones. We can just move some of these good beds over, and that will be good enough. Let's see. Oop, there we go. And let's also build deadfall traps over here. There. And actually, let's set the chop wood order here. It's getting a little dense. Actually, I should do the same thing here. There. So to clear these out. Yeah. Oh, Livy is on top of it. Great. Yeah, auto rearm, but I think they break instantly now. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll have to see. They changed around spike fall traps, basically making them cheaper, but... I think they break more often, or they just, they break. I don't think they broke before, they just, unless something actually, you know, exploded or burned them, they would just be there forever. You just had to reset them, which was neat, but I like the, I do like this decision to make them more of a commodity that, um, you know, you can't spam a room full of them and have raiders forced to walk through it and end up just dying from that, but actually, like, no, they should help, but they shouldn't be the only thing that you're using to defend yourself. Yeah, noticing the colony is getting a little dirty. Yeah, it's a mess in here. Hmm. Yeah, like, I've got Maisie on clean as a one, but it's after cooking, because mainly no one was doing it. Because I kind of need everyone else doing other tasks. And, okay, Harry's doing hauling, that's good. But, um, yeah, I could use someone that, um, one of their first priorities is cleaning, because I'm worried we're going to start getting food sickness from this. Okay, now Macy's tidying up, so that's good. Good. Yeah, but even, even still, it would be good. New recruit? It would still be good. To get um, uh, all this stuff regularly cleaned, as opposed to after everyone's um, uh, finished making the meals, because it's important to do it beforehand. So Sarah has joined. Welcome, Sarah. Let's. Um, oh, your first name's okay. Let's switch that around. Let's call you by your first name, Leslie. Leslie and Leslie. Or Lindsay and Leslie. Okay. Lindsay, Leslie, Livy. Yeah, this won't get confusing. <laughs> uh, okay, let's adjust your work priorities. Where are we here? Da, 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 da. I like to set everyone on one, just that way. You know, you can adjust them lighter, but these are critical tasks that need to get done. So you're good at art. Oh yeah. So you're good. You're an artist and you mine. And let's just turn this off. It's not really your thing. Yeah. Actually, that's good. That's really good. So, Leslie, your priority will be to clean the colony, then do mining tasks, and then you can switch over to doing art and that kind of thing. Which I don't think I've got any art tasks set up at the moment because we're low on bricks and I don't want to use all our wood. But when that gets managed we will definitely do that. We'll be a great artist to make some nice lovely art pieces and beautify our colony a little bit more. That will be good. People will be happier about that. And... Oh, did I not... Oh, no, that, that one is set up to be moved. Wow. All good beds. 
great. Let's actually... Let's uninstall these. Two at a, we'll do it two at a time. And I'll just keep an eye on when they get um, moved out, we'll move these good beds in. And actually, yeah, so that one's going there, two are going there, so that'll be all of them. So we still got one, two normal beds. Okay. Susmoo's caravan has arrived back. Hello, welcome back. Well, uh, we're not going to use that um, tech proof, tech prof. Let's see, we'll either use it on, I mean, the best would be to use it on multi analyzer because that's 4,000. Geothermal, that would be great, but it's a little less, so maybe we'll, we will use it on multi analyzer. This also gets us closer to bionics, which needs fabrication. So. I think that will be the way to go, and it'll speed up research by 10%. So it's a you know it's a good little burst or boost, I should say, not burst to researching. Oh, we've got a manhunter pack of boom rats. Oh, great. Let's see. There's four. Okay. Well, let's um. <laughs> We'll end up fighting them here by all the trees. Oh, great. <laughs> Let's see, Leslie never got you a, a weapon. Let's get... Let's get you something here. Um, sure, the machine pistol. Thomas, you're fine. Susamu, good. Maisie, good. Yep, Circa is not fighting. Lindsay's not really fighting. You've got a gun. Harry... Oh, that's right. He still doesn't have a weapon. Okay, let's consume that fine meal and then get you a club. I think the issue is he keeps dropping them. <laughs> um, oops. Go, you guys. Everyone else. Let's, let's get on this. I don't want the colony burning down in a fire because all these boom rats come. Um, Harry, you're actually going to need to pick up a weapon. Yeah, that one looks great. There you go. Not that I really want to be in melee range with a whole bunch of boom rats, but, um... You know, that's your specialties. Go here. There we go, here they come. Got one. Uh... Oh dear, they're going around. Okay. Okay. Come on, get that one. Uh-oh. Thomas, move. Oh. He's on fire. Boom, got the last one. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Unrecruit. Now we'll get these bloom rats. So let's get you a couple of people to prioritize putting out the fire. Okay, everyone else is going for that one because it's within the home zone. Okay, well, we'll just get these fires put out and then by the time of day, it looks like it's time for everyone to get back to bed. Good job. All right. Good. Oh, well, that didn't go too badly, actually. Ah, uh, Thomas, how badly are you hurt? You've got mm, scratches and stuff. You should really be not playing horseshoes. You should be going to bed and getting treated. Uh, let's set your bed to be medical for a moment and force you to go back to bed and we'll have Lindsay tend to you. Oh, there's... <laughs> these haven't been... These beds haven't been moved, fooey. Well, let's just do this quickly. Sorry, Lindsay, to wake you up. But let's tend to him. I don't want him to get, you know, an infection because he got scratched by a boom rat or burned. You know. Oh, Muffalo hit the trap. Oh. 
Uh, okay, someone's passing by. Huh. I thought they were aware enough that they would avoid the traps, but... Well, I guess the answer to that question is no. So let's make sure... Uh, let's make sure... Yeah, let's just cut it all off here. Two. Make sure they don't get anywhere near those. Let's make sure in Ranch 1 they're also clear. Yeah, okay. Huh. How badly injured are they? Ooh! Actually, really badly injured. Um, Lindsay, let's get you tending. Oh, <laughs> there's our, uh, there's Jova, our visitor. Hello. Seems like they're doing all right, just wandering by. Great memory. Ah, okay. Neat. Fast learner and... Well, it's be a good skill combination to have. Okay, well, looks like... Sorry, I didn't see. Oh, it did get tended. Okay, good. Don't want to lose our muffalos. Still, I check the uh, the wildlife tab every once in a while to see if there's a... Um, Alpaca that's walked onto the map, but haven't seen one. Lots of animals, but no alpaca. It's interesting. It took me a little while to figure out exactly how this is ordered, and as far as I can tell, it's basically um, on animal size. Because you know, you got your large mega sloths going down to kind of more medium size raccoons, and all the way at the bottom, you got squirrels and rats and whatnot. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could reorder that tab. Actually, I should just double check. Can you? I haven't said anything. Let's see, let's pause and do this. Oh, uh, it's sorting them within boom rats. So I've set them to be hunted. Naturally, they're there to the bottom and to the top. Okay, it doesn't prioritize by setting them all the way to the top. And there isn't a name category or something like that. Hmm. Anyways, interesting. Let's turn off those boom rats just for. That was just for interest's sake. Okay. Well, it looks like need more. Who's starving? Krika. Oh, Krika is getting fed. Why are you feeding him rice, Harry? We've got meals. We even have fine meals. Don't feed him rice. Poor guy. Oh my gosh, yeah, recreation <laughs> trapped underground, yeah. Well, when we get... Um, actually, we need Harry to kind of... Mm, prioritize research more. He's basically not getting there. He's spending all his time with Maisie making meals. Let's turn off hauling. So he just does research. We can have other people haul. We got Thomas set the priority haul. A lot of other people will haul as well. Oh, good. And Thomas is replanting. I was getting a little worried that the whole uh, everything's getting very bare around here. Oh, well, um, where is that? Leslie is. Mining, so that is good, and kind of randomly mining different things seen around the map. Working on over here a little bit, down there. That is good. And we're still working, where are we here? Prisoner. Still working on, you've got a lot of resistance, so still working on that, but yeah. Well, this is good. We've got all our deadfall traps, or spike traps, I guess, as they're now called. Um, built. That one's got a blueprint, so it'll be built whenever we get to it. Still need someone to get um, bricks crafted. That's still not happening, which... I'm going to need to work on that and get that addressed. Because I basically stopped... 
building or expanding the colony because we just don't have the bricks right now. And yeah. Anyways, I think we'll deal with that next time. For now, things are going well. No more raids this time, which is a nice break, but I'm sure we'll be raided soon enough. Okay, well, thanks everyone for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.